Go like that, go. <laughs> oh, we're bad pay. Some um, large fries. Anything else? No, that'll be it. Three twenty-five. Thanks. It's raining. Where are we at right now? We are at rallies. Rally someone at, has at the munchies. Ten twenty at night. I get my fucking four dollars. For fries, can you believe it? <laughs> and then they give you the fries, and it's only like this big. Somebody has the munchies. One, two, three, two, three. three what? Twenty-five? I didn't pay attention. Yeah, figures. Dang, what's up with all those ones, though? You gonna make it rain on you later? She's eating cereal. But I don't have enough milk. <laughs> I'll get you more milk. What are you going to do today? Um, I don't know, but guess what I dreamed of last night? What did you dream of last night? Of me eating a banana. You ate a banana? She does not like bananas. In case you guys didn't know. You ate a banana? In my dream. Was it delish? Yeah, it tasted kind of good. Yeah? Yeah, but I don't know if it tastes the same in real life. I think you should try it in real life. I don't know. No? I thought I was in real life. Do you know how when you fall asleep, your dream feels like you're in a life? Yeah. So you thought you were alive in your dream? You should try one in real life, maybe before Christmas. Oh, you're just gonna ignore me now? I got you, I got you. And there's the main unicorn. The baby unicorn. Hey, those are for you. I think someone's trying to steal your boots, Annalise. Um, I don't think they'll fit you, Omar. Oh, yeah, they fit perfect. Look. Mm -mm, mm -mm. No. No? I don't think they fit either. Oh, Elijah said no either. Hi, huh, baby. Hi, papas. Well, oh, the papas. Good morning, papa. And tomorrow is the big day for this little girl. She will be seven. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. So tomorrow. But, tomorrow but, you're going to be seven? Mm -hmm. I thought tomorrow you're going to be eight. Remember 21? Uh, you remember 21? Remember? Um, no. Okay. That was just, <laughs> that was just a prank table. Oh, okay. Um, oh. Last year of being spoiled? Yes. So enjoy it while you can. <laughs> Why? Because next year you're going to share it with Elisha. And it's not all about you no more. Next year, Elijah will be one. Exactly. So he'll be able to open stuff <coughs> and play with things. And talk. And talk. But we have to train him. It's probably going to take him a year. No, it'll take a few months. But yeah. We'll be talking at one, hopefully. Yeah, we can do I'll be talking again. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Oof. What? Jeez. Stink. His feet or his poopies? Oof, everything, feet, stomach, smells like dough up. Oh, in your face.
Put your face. Still going. He's a stretching and dress. We just gotta get him some socks. Hi, Popeyes. Missy mm -hmm. mm -hmm. He's just mad because I won't carry him, huh? Huh, Papa? You want me to carry you all day, all the time? Yes, you do. All day, all the time. You're heavy, puppies. You're heavy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> You're really heavy. <laughs> my arm is numb now. I got all this muscle now because of you, and my arm is numb. But you're still, I love you. Yeah, I still love you. So, with the leftover albondiga, I just added some noodles and some more veggies, and I made this like almost chicken noodle soup. It's delicious. And it's perfect for this rainy day. It's so good. There was like one albondiga left and a couple veggies. So I just used the, the juice and just added. It looks like chicken noodle and it actually really tastes like chicken noodle from the bottle or the can, I guess. But it's really delicious. So if you guys have some extra albondigas or just extra anything, there's always something that you can make. So don't be afraid to try things out. They always come out pretty well. So I'm cooking some chicken. I put some garlic, and some onions. I'm about to put some tomatoes, some honey, some soy sauce. Combo to be bomb. Making some rice. We got our co-pilot here. He's helping me, huh? Hi, Papa. Hi, Elijah. You gonna help cook? Oh, he's getting a little antsy. But it's okay. It's okay. I'm about to make a feast. Hey guys, so I replanted some green onions in my little garden outside and I just thought that maybe I can replant some celery because I just put some in my chicken and you totally can. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. But I guess you can plant it inside. So I'm just going to cut the little heart or whatever it's called right here and then plant it and I guess we'll see how it goes throughout the video. So keep watching basically all you do is cut all the cut it like that and then you're gonna cut a little bit of this off so that way the roots can grow and just put in like a little cup of water and every day a couple days you grow it and then you're gonna start seeing the stop the top part like flower and then you're basically replant it in some dirt and hey you got some celery growing so we're gonna try i don't know how long it grows but i know in a couple days or weeks i'll be able to replant it in some soil so that's pretty exciting because then i won't have to buy celery no more and i can replant it Woo -hoo. this chicken looks amazing i will let you know how it tastes i am going to wait for omar to get home so we can eat together and taste it. I'm not gonna lie, I might sneak a sneak peer view for myself because I'm bored and I'm hungry. <sighs> but anyways, I just did the celery. So basically I put it in my little um, wall of plants because that's what I have. And there's the starfish. I don't know if it goes there, but it's gonna go there for now because I really wanna put it up, but I don't know if I should put it up by this turtle or that turtle but this turtle has more color so I feel like it stands out more and over there it will just be like super plain and white unless I paint it which I probably won't but maybe I'm at least can and those are my plants my money tree my aloe my bamboo I don't know what that plant is called I don't know what that plant is called but it's growing now my other little plants and that's where I put the celery and this is the closest that it's gonna get to any sunlight even though right now it's raining, but later on, those are my other plants that are dying. RIP to those plants. But yeah, we'll keep in touch about how that uh, celery is going. And my onions, well, they're pretty cool. This is my outside. My marigold, my, I don't know. This is a chili tree. This is a tomato. Uh, cherry tomatoes but I don't know 
if it's growing or not. I replanted it, so hopefully to this big pot. Yeah, I'm not a good planter. I'm not that big, but I like plants. And there's my green onions. They're growing. How exciting. Stay tuned. Are you going to record me, huh? How was it? Huh? How was it? What? The food? No. The what? air. Well, I haven't even tried it. It's still well, hot. Try it. Well, dang. No, bro, no. It's still too hot. <laughs> it's good. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> it was really good. Hmm. I did serve myself some. Mine looks better than his though, cause he is lame and he warmed his up <laughs> through the microwave. He got a little dry. Instead of waiting. But it's still good. Look. Well done. Mm. The rice is good too. Tastes bomb. I gotta give it to give it to you, dude. Make good dinners, man. Thank you. <sighs> Make it sound like I never do good dinners. <laughs> I've been starving for four days, guys. So finally, she thought about making dinner. Wow. <laughs> That's what Look at even he's laughing. Oh, never mind. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Papa. Hi. Hi. Papa. Hi, Papa. Hermoso. Hi. Hi. See what happens when you wait? Instead of just warming it up, <laughs> looks delish. And it is. Isn't it? Isn't mine better? Yeah, it is. Yours is better. <laughs>